To access the Chicago Manual of Style, begin at the WVU Library's homepage, lib.wvu.edu. Select the Books Media tab over the center search box. Type Chicago Manual of Style Online in the box and press Enter. Notice that many results may come up. We're looking for the ebook edition, which is easy to find because of the, the large blue View ebook button. If this option doesn't come up at the top of your results, use the filters on the left to eliminate the formats you don't want, like print book. By eliminating the print books, we're left with just three titles. Click on the View eBook button below the title Chicago Manual of Style. Your book should look like this. If you happen to have opened the Chicago Manual of Style 16th edition, simply use the Click to go to CMOS 17 button to access the 17th edition. Previously, you watched a video that showed you how to navigate the online Chicago Manual of Style. I recommend you become acquainted with the table of contents. Part 1 and Part 2 cover many useful points about proper formatting in your text. Part 3, specifically Chapter 14, is the section you will use most. Musicology uses the Chicago Manual of Style notes and bibliography pattern. Chapter 14 is very detailed and can be a bit overwhelming at first glance. With practice, you will find your way around with more ease. Following the overview, basic format, and notes sections, you will find the bibliographies section. Here are examples of almost every type of source you'll ever need to cite. For instance, section 14.98 shows how to handle non-English titles of cited work. Section 14.107 shows how to cite a chapter in a multi-author book. There are many helpful online guides to the Chicago Manual of Style but the manual itself is the authoritative source.